Hello, and welcome back to Kids Camp. Are you excited for another fun adventure? Me too. Hey, do any of you know where we are today? We are here at Meyer Garden. They have a variety of art and plant species that we can see today. We will see examples of both. Come on, you guys, let's go inside. We're here just outside of this garden. This garden area is special because we learn about our senses. It's signed like this. Do you know about your senses? We have five senses. We are gonna learn about them together. Come on, let's go. Okay, we're gonna be talking about our senses. The first sense is touch. We sign it like this. We can touch things or sign it like that. We describe what we feel, different textures. We could talk about the temperature, how we feel pain. Let me give you an example. You might see a leaf and you can feel the leaf. Maybe the leaf is soft. Or another example, you have a puppy and you feel that it's soft. Some leaves, however, can be bumpy and it might feel like a frog and the bumps on the back of a frog. If you're going outside, you might see a rock and the sun is shining on the rock and you touch it and you realize that Ooh, it's hot. Or maybe outside it's snowing and you touch that same rock and it's now cold. Our second sense is through our ears. It's our sense of hearing. We're gonna sign here like this. You might hear music or maybe an airplane flying overhead and it's loud jet engines. Some people can't hear at all. They are deaf, just like me. Our third sense 
We use our eyes. What do you do though with your eyes? We see with our eyes. This is a sign for see. You can look around, see with your eyes. Right now, I see different flowers. I see clouds in the sky. Some people can't see though. They are blind. So when you can't see, we use the word blind in the sign like that. Our fourth sense that we might have is our mouth. We have a sense that we use our mouth. We use it for our sense of taste. The sign for taste is like this. You use your sense of taste when you eat. You might taste pizza. Mmm or you bite into an apple and use your sense of taste. My favorite thing to taste is apple juice. And as you look around at plants and leaves, some leaves can taste like mint or have other flavors. For our fifth sense, we use our nose. What do you do with your nose? That's right. We use our nose to smell. The sign for smell is this. Sometimes you might smell something that's good. Sometimes you might smell something that has an awful odor. It smells bad. And you know what animal has a terrible smell? You guessed it, a skunk. The sign for that is skunk. Ugh, they stink. So wow. We've talked about our five senses. Great job today.